looking for a victory. Ken Flex Wheeler, our first heavyweight out of Los Angeles, California. Yes, he's impressive. I mean, how can you not think this? Look at the small waist on this gentleman. Look at the delts, the arms. He's, he's really very, very symmetrical. Does he have a waist? Nice guy, too. He trains at the, at the, the Gold in Venice, where I train. He really is a nice guy. Well, you know, not only is he gigantic, but Flex Wheeler has his own little trademark. And he talks about that when we spoke with him earlier today. It's became kind of a trademark with me, and um, I really like it. To, I feel that the audience really liked the name Flex, and also I try to live off of that, you know. And it's just a little extra something, you know, it's really catchy. And I really like the name, and I'll probably change my real name to Flex, you know. Well, we go from one nickname to another, from Flex Wheeler to Quadzilla. Paul DeMay out of Boston, Massachusetts, the 1991 Junior National Champion. I wonder why they call him Quadzilla. You know, he reminds me from the waist down of Platts. Look at the side of the thigh. Amazing. Huge arms to go with it. He looks great. Well, he also poses well, and uh, whether he wins the heavies or not, he's an award winner because Paul DeMeo gets the Weeder Award as the best poser. Paul DeMeo, on behalf of Weeder Health and Fitness, I want to present you with the Weeder Best Posing Award for the 1991 Men's National NPC Championship. Congratulations, Paul. I'd like to thank Weta Health and Fitness for this fabulous award. Um, I feel very honored to be chosen for this. Uh, I'd also like to thank Ed Connors from Gold's Gym, who made this all possible, and uh, my friends and family, Marty Demersion, Jill, who just people who stood by me, and you mean a lot to me. Thank you. From Quadzilla back to Flex, Flex Wheeler is standing backstage with Carla Dunlop. I'm joined by Ken Flex Wheeler. I can guess how you got the name Flex, but why don't you tell me? <laughs> um, it was just a nickname that uh, people used to tease me when I was younger. And as I got older, um, I found that people liked the name, so I just incorporated it into my routine and everything, and it's a, it's a big bang now. As it... You not only incorporated it into your routine, but you incorporated it into his head. <laughs> Well, Flex, you're going to put some chinks into some plans here for, uh, there was supposed to be a heavyweight showdown between a few other competitors, but I think you're going to really shock them. Um, I don't know. The, the competitors are outrageous. Um, I was able to dial in the best that I could, best, better than I ever have in my life, but the competitors are just outrageous. I wouldn't dare to say who's <laughs> going to win at this point. Well, we're not going to guess either, but I'll tell you something. We're going to take it back to the competition and find out. We still have Kevin Lavroni, Matt Mendenhall, and more of the heavyweights after this timeout. Continue with the heavyweight division and Matt Mendenhall from Lakewood, Colorado. Wow, look how big and thick Matt, Matt is. Amazing. Matt's been in the game for a long time. Used to live out in L.A. I'm really glad to see him back in the circuit, really. This is a body that, you know, should be out there. Why not in the pros? Well, <laughs> Good question, because he definitely should be out there. I don't know, you know. You know, your personal life has a lot to do with it, you know. I don't know what goes on in his personal life, but, I mean, he should be a, in the pros. Matt Mendenhall, a veteran of the game. And now we move to Kevin Lavrone from Glen Burnie, Maryland. Now, to me, he looks just a tad sharper than he did the last time I saw him. Look at this. He cut his hair. He cut yeah. his hair, too, right? He looks great. <laughs> Good music. Excellent. What a thick man. Very thick. Look at the pecs. The skin is paper thin. Exactly. He should do really well. Look at the, th the side of the thighs. That line in there. Well, you know, we saw Paul DeMeo, who won the Junior Nationals this past summer, and Kevin LeBron finished second. He talks about what he did to improve upon that finish. Well, I uh, switched a few things in my diet. Uh, stick, I stuck to the diet longer this time, you know, instead of... Uh, I drug it out for a longer period of time so that I could peak at this show, since it was a pro show. 
I just want to make a statement at the juniors, and I think I did that. And, um, you know, I just wanted to come in this show the best shape that I possibly could. So I trained on different equipment and uh, did a lot of isolation, you know, for the muscles, high-intensity reps, things like that, you know, Stairmaster riding the bike. Uh, before, I didn't do that for the juniors. So, you know, I kind of saved the little best for last, you know. All right, interesting comments from Kevin. And now our final heavyweight, Ronnie Coleman out of Arlington, Texas. This is a tough class because all of these guys have peaked. They're in great shape. Look at the delts in the arms. <laughs> Unbelievable. Working his routine. Triceps. Look at his triceps. He's got them striations in the lower head there. Thighs. <laughs> his big old rock biceps. He looks great. Vascular. It's a tough class. Very tough class. Ronnie Coleman. All right. And now it is time uh, to get set for the heavy weight. The pose down. Fifth place, Matt Mendenhall. Matt Mendenhall well. comes in fifth, does the veteran. Bring him all the way down here if you would please. Amazing. Well, he could have been a little harder, but I think Matt's happy with just getting back out there. I really do. I think Ronnie Coleman will come in fourth. Ronnie Coleman. Ronnie uh -oh. Coleman. Oh, well, you go. Well, because you can tell who the big three are in this division. Yes. And you're getting much, much better on all of this. You're really starting to know the sport here, Bob. Oh, the way I'm you impressed. lecture me, huh? Let's find out. Paul DeMeo. Paul DeMeo, uh. Quadzilla, the junior national champion, comes in third here in the Nationals. And you see Lee Haney. He's a nice man. Percent. They're both very nice. Here we go. Here we go. This is tough. Lex Wheeler comes oh. in second. Oof. Kevin Lavrone from Glen Burnie, Maryland, Oof. is the heavyweight winner. Wow. Tough call. Kevin looks wow. great. Flex looks great. I mean, you know why? Hey, we're not finished. We have the overall competition. All five okay. weight classes square off after this timeout.